Hey everyone, hope you're doing well. Just wanted to do a quick video today. Uh, a little bit different of a video too. I wanted to put together a streetwear fit from Amazon. I know, hitting you with that original content, 100% original, never been done before. But uh, anyways, as you can see, here we are on Amazon.com, blah, blah, blah. Oh my God, don't look at my recent order. But the basics of what I was trying to go for is something with cargos cargo shorts maybe uh, or probably cargo pants right and then actually I was looking at some uh, striped shirts maybe long sleeve as you can see here um, such as this we men slim fit long sleeve casual shirt looking very fitted but look ooh, that's kind of fire honestly but anyways also, I wanted to throw in a little bit of accessories. Uh, as you can see, here are some bandanas. Eh? You can get some skull ones. Don't look at my neck right now, I'm wearing one. Um, that's kind of sus, you might not like that, but eh, we will see. We're experimenting, guys, experimenting. Um, and also, I uh, went ahead and uh, got some of these tote bags too as a nice little accessory. Kind of different if you're just going to class and you need to carry some notebooks with you. It's different than a backpack. Kind of switches up the look of a fit too. And what's cool about these is you can paint them and do like kind of cool designs on them. So basically, that is the gist of this video. So I just ordered everything and let's see how it all looks when it comes in. Might look trash, I don't know. If it does, just let me know. And yeah, I will see you in the future. Also, I'm excluding shoes and my belt from this outfit, like shopping cart, uh, just because uh, shoes are kind of expensive and uh, once like the fit I'm putting together, you can kind of wear almost any type of basic sneaker with it. And then also a belt, you could use about any belt. In my shopping cart, I didn't actually order a whole nother pair of shoes, cause like, why? Um, but yeah, so I guess not a full outfit from Amazon, but I am aware of that, so yeah, cool. So the outfit was delivered uh, in a very timely manner, thank you Amazon Prime. Uh, but I'm gonna talk about kind of the inspiration on why I wanted to get some of these pieces and different ways you can style it outside of this outfit as well. Um, Cause I try to keep it pretty versatile so you can swap it out with different fits. But with that being said, let's get into the outfit. So starting with the pants, cause I think that's one of my favorite pieces from this outfit. They definitely gave off to me like a 2004 Abercrombie and Fitch vibe to it. Uh, just because of that olive color. Um, and then the material used kind of these dangly straps to like tying the ankles down. They're definitely super long, so they I think might look kind of cool if they end up fraying as you walk on them. But if they end up getting too annoying, you can always just cut them. Cargo pocket down on your kind of shin calf area. Same design, just larger on your upper thigh and then same design on your back pocket to keep your wallet in. I definitely think for streetwear, I think cargo pants like this work very well. Now you do have these internal drawstrings here, which are cool. And I have them out right now just to add a little bit more character, I assume. But you can always just tuck them in. So you don't actually need to wear a belt with it, but the belt I am wearing, I got on Amazon like more than a year ago. It's just like a knockoff Cobra belt for like $8. Oh, there was this like zipper pocket and I went to open it. So I unzip it and then I try and open it and it's just like a fake pocket. So I was a little bit disappointed with that. But um, other than that, the fit of the pants I actually really like because they are baggy, but they're not too baggy, not sloppy baggy. So you can still wear kind of a fitted t-shirt up top and I think it would look okay. I am ordering a size 32 in the pants. It's a little bit tight, a little bit tighter than most 32s. So I probably could have sized up to a size 33 with them. I know sometimes with a little bit cheaper clothes, sizes run a little bit smaller because they're like cheaping out on fabric used. But I still think they work just fine. Now the shoes I'm wearing with this fit are just Air Force Ones, which I know is a very basic default shoe, but I do think it works well. I was going to wear like Vans Old Schools with it, but I think Vans Old Schools and baggy cargo pants for streetwear fits is a little bit played out. So, I mean, not that Air Force Ones are much better, but I do think a shoe that would work are these Puma Thunder Deserts that I have. Um, because it has that earthy tone through the shoe, it kind of matches the vibe of the kind of the earthy olive green in the pants and kind of with the rest of the fit as well. Um, so I might be wearing these sometimes with 
this outfit. But pretty much any just kind of basic sneaker. You can actually wear like Jordan 1s with this fit. If you're not wearing a striped shirt like Adidas Superstars or any other Adidas shoes. But because I'm wearing stripes on the shirt, I think Adidas shoes are a no-go for this just because it might be a little bit too stripe heavy. Moving on to the shirt, uh, I was gonna go with a long sleeve, but I thought for a summertime short sleeve is the way to go. I really like the stripes on this because they are a little bit thicker, but it's not super high contrast because it's a light gray and then a white. Now I do have a long sleeve from that same exact brand, same stripe width, but it's super high contrast, it's black and white and long sleeve, so it kind of looks like you broke out of prison. For this fit, I think the more muted contrast works much better. Also, moving on to this little tote bag right here. Um, I ended up picking up some fabric paint and painting this little like skull on it. Hopefully it's not too cringy. Um, I ended up getting like a 12 pack of tote bags. So I was gonna use some to go grocery shopping with too. Um, and then picked up some fabric paint because um, kind of like a little arts and crafts project. I wanted to paint a bunch of these with some different designs on them for some different outfits and everything. Now, the last part uh, of this outfit that I want to talk about is this little neckerchief. It's just a bandana that you tie around your neck. But I was really inspired by Jacob Keller because he wears a lot of neckerchiefs a lot with his fits and I think he pulls it off really well. Um, I do think it's a kind of a cool accessory for streetwear fits. When I first got it, it was like super rigid because it's brand new. So what I did is I wetted it, threw it in the dryer, kind of crumpled it up. And then before wearing it, I usually wet it and then wrap it around and then tie around your neck. That way it lays a little bit more naturally and the fabric is softer so it lays nicer on your neck. If you don't want to tie around your neck, you could always tie it around the edge of a tote bag. But because it's a white bandana and then I have white in the shirt, I don't think it's a super high contrast, so I still think it works. I was kind of worried about wearing a bandana around the neck and a striped shirt. I thought it might be a little bit too much, but I do think it works okay. Now, I was gonna order a trucker hat for this outfit, but I think that might be a little bit too much because of the stripes, the bandana around the neck, kind of the design on the tote bag, and the super loud pants. I think it just might, have, might be a little bit too much. Um, also, I just got a haircut, so I don't really need to wear a hat. But yeah, no, that is the Amazon outfit that I put together. Let me know what you think of this outfit. If you like any of the pieces, how you would style it, anything like that, just let me know. Also, let me know if you guys like these style videos from different stores, or I could do like possibly a tech wear outfit from Amazon as well. Oh, also, thank you to everyone who subscribed. I really appreciate all the support, and uh, I'll see you in your video pretty soon. So.